Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you are doing well. I pray for you all. God give you a long life and you live always happily there. Please like and share this video and also subscribe my YouTube channel. I have very best to you all. Watch this video till end for supporting me. So let's start with the information. These are some updates on the NAR. Before starting the video, I have to tell you something. Go to google.com and search janaropinions.com and open this site. Here you can see the latest news, dinar opinions, and dinar guru updates on a single page. So visit this site for more information. Article, Iraq is trying to join the World Trade Organization. Quote, Iraq needs to diversify its economy in a flexible manner, such as the agricultural, industrial and investment sectors. And that Iraq's accession to the World Trade Organization be useful as one of the tools for building a market economy. Within the standards of the global market and a tool for achieving reforms and decisions to achieve these measures. Article, Iraq is looking to accelerate its accession to the World Trade Organization. Iraq recently became a trading partner with India and in seeking inclusion in the unified payment system. That will allow them to go across borders sometimes by land sometimes by sea seeking more demand for their currency which gives it more value. There are no issues, problems, delays. Everything is moving forward. Do you understand that? It's a perpetual motion of moving forward. Nowhere do I see any stalling standing still. No. Everything is moving forward, leaning forward picking up speed, there is no delay. I know that we have a really good situation with the rates. They have a fixed rate that they plan to offer us on our dinar it's very good very high. There's also, the planned rate to offer us, for any dom. The Central Bank of Iraq issued, on Saturday, directives to all banks to take new controls. Regarding prepaid cards for the purpose of regulating financial movements that take place inside Iraq. A document obtained by Shafak News Agency showed that the directives included the ceiling for withdrawals for local financial movements inside Iraq that are made through ATMs for prepaid cards shall be 2 million, 2 million Iraqi dinars per day instead of 395,000 Iraqi dinars. The Central also recommended, raising the ceiling of the purchase movement through points of sale. Inside Iraq to be 10 million, 10 million Iraqi dinars, with a commitment not to exceed the monthly limit for charging the card. Which amounts to, 10 million, with reducing the ceiling of electronic purchase to be, 750, US dollars per day. He stressed that banks should work to expand your agent network by contracting with entities that are allowed to sell and market this type of card. He stressed, the local financial movements on prepaid cards are excluded with the commitment contained in paragraph, 5, of the above circulars. Related to Merchant Category Codes, MCC, provided that they are within the legitimate purposes of purchase and payment. 